Hi and Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome back once again to Technology Information Channel. Today I want to explain and understand how to read the charging alternator wiring circuits and how to understand. Okay. And how this all terminals is connect to each other. Okay. Before the starting the video, I just want to request to all of you, if you are first time on my channel, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification for more let's update videos. Okay. Basically, and the market and every kind of engine generators have some different types of alternator. Some alternator have two wires, some alternator have three wires, some alternator have four wires. But we are today explain the four wire alternator because we cover overall terminals of each kind of alternator and only in this video okay how to rewire the alternator and how to understand the charging alternator circuits and how these wires join back together okay you can see i already uh, draw the diagram this is our charging alternator this is our battery okay and this is our charging alternator terminals b i g s l how to connect this wire and the system okay this is for the neutral or b negative this is for the positive b positive b plus okay First of all, we take from here the and join to the alternator body. But the charging alternator body is already connected with the engine chassis or engine. That's mean that's getting battery ground from the engine. Okay. After that, here is our battery past. Okay. B plus is going from here there. Directly. Here is starter. Starter motor B plus and battery B plus and also charging alternator B B plus is connected back together. Okay. After that, the IG ignition switch. This is our ignition switch. Okay. This is connected from the with the battery positive okay when you on the ignition switch when you on the ignition switch it send command to the load this IG is connected to the load side and IG to connect it from the antenna side be positive okay when you off this ignition switch the load will be off like a radio uh, radiator fan and uh, so my headlights etc okay and the generator when you turn on the ignition switch the fuel pump is the electric fuel pump turning on and fuel solenoid is turning on okay and the generator panel in our log and digital meters is turning on when you when you off the ignition switch the load is also off okay this is the ignition switch after that here is our another terminal 
This means sensing voltage. This alternator has a regulator inside, which for the to maintain the battery voltage and for the safety of the battery, not to overcharge the battery. Okay. This sense terminals. This is terminals is directly connected with the battery positive. When our engine is running, the charging alternator charging the battery, and again the regulator sense the battery voltage. When the battery voltage is reached to the 14.5 or 14.7, that's when makes the charging cut off. Okay. When the charging is cut off, the battery is running the load. Then the charging will little bit goes down for 13 volt or 12 volt. That's again turning on. Since from here the battery voltage on to, through the S terminal, then again connect the charging system again to the battery, and this will again charging the battery. When the battery voltage again reach to the 14. 0.5 or 14% this automatically shut down the charging system to the bed. Okay, this working automatically, regulator working. Okay. After that, the last one, the light circuit. Okay. Here we have one light. Okay. First of all, we take one wire from here to light one side okay and take one another wire from here and directly connect it to the IG okay when we turning on the light the ignition we, when we turning on the ignition switch to the on position after that the lights grow up when we start the engine this send the this an off condition this send the ground send the battery negative to the light the light glowing when we start the engine the alternator start the charging that disconnect the ground B negative from this side turning off the B negative that's mean the sign of when the running condition this lights blink off that's mean or charge alternator is okay when this Continuously glow up, that means our charging alternator or regulator is not working, or the charging circuit is issued. This is the indication lights for the okay. This is indication lights for the charging system. Okay, I hope you understand. This the basic circuits. Thanks for watching the complete video. See you next time and goodbye. Assalamualaikum.